Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. So today is uh, self-care Sunday and the prompt for today is to um, do a little decorating for fall. doesn't have to be much even if you're just putting out a um, a wreath or some leaves as I have here. Um, yeah this is my entryway. I'm not going to show the whole thing because my husband is in the process of organizing and trying to sell a bunch of his candle stuff. So um, it's kind of a mess right at the moment. But here's some of my decorations. Those are like uh, velvet-like um, pumpkins. And that's my red cardinal. I keep I actually keep that out all year long. And then this is a... Um, this stays out all year too. It's a, a met, metal fountain that we got on one of our anniversary trips. It doesn't have any water going in it right now, but it does sometimes. Um, yeah, a little owl. And then some more of those velvet pumpkins. And then this candlestick holder, very, it's very old. It used to be my mom's. She gave it to me years ago. Um, it's wooden, so it's pretty cool. And then there's a little figurine, a little kitty, again, from my mom. Had it for many years. So then we go over here, and I have this um, pretty wreath that's hanging up. Got this weird thing sticking out here. Not sure what's going on there. There, that looks a little better. So there's that and then um, yeah and so then this is my dining room again my husband I'm not sure what he's doing with that turntable um, he got a new one so um, he likes to collect and hoard things and then sell them at some point so I just kind of ignore all that stuff and just look at the pretty stuff so this is my uh, Horn of Plenty. Um, you can see we're prepping some more potatoes to go out into the, to be planted. Um, we've been eating fresh potatoes from our garden all summer and they're delicious. So that's my Horn of Plenty. A lot of the stuff I've just collected over the years and um, I really like that. So this is my, this piece of furniture right here um, this was my grandma's she called it a credenza so that's what I call it it has all of my um, well it has my china my my grandma's old china and um, like serving platters and things I don't use very often and then this is my this is my little area so I have these dried flower arrangements and a couple little trucks and a little, that little guy in the back, that's a wax little candle thing, <laughs> but I just bring them out every year. And when they get too dirty, I just, um, I just throw them away. So let me turn the lights on. Okay, so then I have little lights and then hang on, look at this pretty thing while I turn on my, my house lights. Okay. So, this is my Bigfoot brew house. <laughs> I love it so much. So yeah, so there's a Yeti uh, serving some beer. A couple patrons sitting there. I don't know if you can see the little tag hanging down uh, right here. It says um, Bigfoot brew house. Um, but I'm totally completely in love with it. And then I have these little uh, trick-or-treaters, little Smurfs. Um, and then that old um, kind of gnarly looking tree. That was my mom's also. She also gave that to me years ago. And then my troll. Did anyone else play with trolls when they were a kid? Um, I sure did. I loved them. So yeah, so I have my little skeleton troll. And they all hang out at the... Um, and you know, I used to have a haunted house, but when I saw this, I was like, oh no, I have to get this. So that's that. And then we come in 
to um, our living room. Our dogs are, one is right there. The other one is right there. And they're, um, they're on duty because my husband left the house. So they have to watch for him. That's like their job. So then here on our coffee table, I just have this pumpkin stand. It's metal and uh, just a little, um, I don't know what you call it, a garland. Yeah, a garland of leaves right there. And then I have my mantle. So um, not so much for fall, but during Christmas, this is where all my treasured pieces go that I never wanted my kids to touch. Um, but now it just has uh, just cute Halloween stuff. So there's another thing, um, a garland of leaves there. And then a couple of cute little pumpkin guys. And then this jack-o'-lantern. And honestly, all of, besides my brew house that I just got this year, all of these things are year, at least 20 years old. And I just put them away and bring them back out. Everything I got up here, I think except these two and that in the back, um, I, my mom gave to me. She, all of this stuff. She used to buy stuff and use it for a couple years and get bored of it and buy new stuff. And so I would get all of her old stuff. So that was pretty cool. And then I have my, my little skull. In the old days, I put candle, little tea light candles in these, but uh, I don't do that anymore. Now I just put lights in. So that's it. And we have, um, it's a beautiful day. Um, you can see the neighbor's tree right here is starting to turn. Um, but otherwise, so far, that's all the fall color we have in the neighborhood. Um, I'll periodically do some more videos um, of leaves changing but uh, yeah that's it that's what we have for today um, my dogs make they just mangle my furniture look at her Penny Lane are you a sweet girl and then here's my loaf my big boy hi Tuck Tuck hi can you say hi? He hates having his picture taken. But look how cute you are. Look at, look at, look at how cute you are. Okay, so that's that's my decorations. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you are inspired to um, get some of your fall decorations out or maybe plan to go find some. Um, thrift stores are a good place if you don't have a lot of... Um, you know money to spend I get it I've bought stuff at thrift stores before um, so yeah so that's it I hope you all have a great day and um, one last look at the fabulous brew house oh I should say I got this at Michael's um, I went in the store because they they said they had some in stock and there was none there so I had to order it online and I ordered it about a month ago so I'm not sure the availability now, but anyway, that's all I have. So have a great day and remember to be good to yourself. Bye.